This program is a way to develop awareness with children um, of alternative fuels and uh, the possibility of using something that doesn't require any fossil fuels or any burning of anything that uh, pollutes the atmosphere at all. Well, the program is about things that are powered by solar panels and it's trying to help save gasoline and help our Earth. Well, it works by uh, a standards-based science program linked to ideas that hopefully open up their minds to what's going to happen in the future. I learned that, um, that the sun can actually go down into these little panels and the panels can store it and also give off energy to make a bunch of things run, like the electricity in your house. The future leaders of our society and of, of our country are in my classroom today and they're only nine years old, but they're going to be 21 years old and they're gonna be the leaders of our cities and our towns. And if they understand what to do and, and are able to get solutions to the problems that we have now, I think we'll have, live in a bit better society uh, in, in 10 or 15 years time. Solar Solutions fits in perfectly with our school mission. At La Costa Heights, we like to provide students with opportunities to have hands-on experience with their learning. In Solar Solutions, students can actually explore their science standards through unique project-based learning opportunities. Um, they build ovens, they've gone to Legoland, interviewed people in the field to really see what different types of Solar Solutions offer. Sorry, the problem that it solves, hopefully, is the reliance on fossil fuels um, and hopefully I give the students skills to solve problems like that because the problems they'll be having they'll be facing much more globally environmentally um, affected solutions in the future. My favorite part is um, knowing that our earth is going to be a better environment when well eventually when there's more solar powered cars and more people are using them.